Today I am going to show you a very simple but effective video editing tutorial which is animated cinematic blackbirds in Premiere Pro. If you want to get the cinematic look in Premiere Pro then it is important to add cinematic blackbirds. You already noticed a few video clips with music on the timeline where we are going to add cinematic blackbirds to get the cinematic look. First we have to right click on the project to get the adjustment layer. We accept the default settings by hitting OK. Now it is time to place the adjustment layer so let's grab the adjustment layer and place it at the top of the all video layers. To cover all the videos we must extend the duration of the adjustment layer. At this moment we have to apply the crop effect to the adjustment layer. So let's go to the effects. If you don't find the effects you can easily enable it from the window at the top bar. Inside the search box type crop to find it. Now grab this crop effect, move over to the timeline and apply it to the adjustment layer. Now we have to go to the effect controls and you will find the crop effect there. We will change a couple of settings to this effect to get the animated cinematic black bars. First drag the time indicator to the beginning frame, set keyframes for the top and bottom by clicking on the stopwatch. Next drag the time indicator to the right around 2 seconds. You can see it in the time code here. This time we have to add two keyframes for the top and bottom by clicking on these little icons. If you increase the value of the top then you can see the black bar. I wanna increase its value to 10%. For the bottom its value will be similar to the top's value. Here you can see the changes. Now we can play the video. Ok, it is time to ease in the two keyframes to smooth the animation. So select both keyframes and right click any of the selected keyframes to enable ease in. So we made animated cinematic black bars for the beginning part of the video. Now it is time for the ending part. Let's move the time indicator to the last frame of the video. Then set two keyframes. You can see the time code 30 seconds. We will now go back to around 5 seconds. So let's type here 32 and hit the enter key on the keyboard. Again add two keyframes by clicking these icons. Now click any of the right arrow icons to select the last keyframes. Change its value from 10% to 50%. For the bottom we do the same thing. That's all for today's Premiere Pro tutorial. I hope you enjoy this tutorial that helps you to make a cinematic video. See you later in the next video till then goodbye.